I am here with Dirk Bentley, who has a new album, a new film, and he just keeps on rising. So I gotta ask yes. you this about the record. There's bourbon, and there's whiskey, and there's tall boys, and there's cold ones. Yeah. There's lots, there's lots of drinking going on there in There is. I, I haven't thought of that. And usually I talk about this record, you know, there's a lot of questions about, obviously, my dad passing away and right. my son being born, but I love that, because I haven't actually talked about that. And that is, there's, yeah, there's bourbon in Kentucky, there's a, a stewardess pouring whiskey and drunk in a plane. Right. There's cold ones on the, uh, the song Back Porch. So yeah, there's a lot of alcohol involved. I guess as you uh, grow, uh, grow a little older and deal with some of life circumstances, uh, alcohol plays a key, uh, key role in it. And it is country music, so. And lots of moods on this record. Talk about going to this album, and this, is, this seems like a big record, like an important record yeah. for you. It is an important record. Uh, you know, I, I try to just dissect all the little things that are going on when I was making this record, but really it's just a reflection of life. And for me, life right now is really crazy, really full. Um, the record started with my dad uh, he passed away uh, about a year and a half ago, so that was kind of the initial um, thing I was kind of writing from. And initial thing I was, when I was looking for songs, that was kind of really in the forefront of my mind and my heart. Uh, mm -hmm. And then, kind of halfway through the process, my wife got pregnant, and we found out we we're having our first little boy. So um, a lot of like new feelings of just gratitude and excitement about that. So there's a lot of a range of emotions, and um, that all kind of finds its way in the record. Uh, and I, again, I just think it's a reflection of uh, life for me right now. And, Mm -hmm. Touring full time, career's doing great. I got a family and three kids. You know, it's just like these two worlds colliding, so it creates a lot of a good substance for uh, for songwriting. Cool. Well, we're here in the theater for a reason. Yeah, you actually, you actually have a film. There's a visual component to this. There movie. is. Yeah, this is uh, not something I'm really that comfortable with. Uh, yeah. This is a, the third time we've done a, a screening. One up in Toronto and one in Nashville. And now we're here in L.A. Uh, yeah, it was my, my manager's idea to kind of maybe capture some of the stuff that's going on because it is, like I said, an interesting time for me if I was ever going to make a home video to document what this lifestyle is like, yeah. you know, having a career and having uh, kids. Uh, now would be the time to do it. You know, my dad just passing away and I'm assuming this new role is kind of the head of the, you know, the, the lead captain on the on the plane. And uh, so there's a lot of grief in that, but um, just a lot of responsibility and a lot of fun, you know, with the touring. So it's all kind of coming together you get a chance to see it all in the documentary, and um, it's like the greatest home video for me ever to have personally. It's a little uncomfortable for it to play out in front of other people, because uh, it goes from the stage to the delivery room. I mean, it's like my whole life in the last two years. And, uh, so, uh, but I know my fans would really like it, and uh, that's why we, we did it, and uh, I look forward to them seeing it, and hearing what they think, and uh, giving them a little more with each album. Well, thank you everyone for watching Extra on YouTube. And for updates on the latest celebrity news, subscribe to our channel here. Like us on Facebook here or follow us on Twitter here. Yes, and if you want your voice heard, leave a comment below. Where? Below. <laughs>